so from 60 degree weather with hill storms and whatnot back to the air conditioning we arrived at Lake Powell I think like uh, maybe even a thousand feet lower than we were this morning and we can feel it we're back in Las Vegas weather basically with all the air goes on my little brother's not feeling great yeah we're gonna take it easy so it's a lot later in the day now uh, we just went to the city of Page, which is nearby to have some dinner and uh, didn't do a whole lot else but right now we're gonna go take a bath uh, we're at Lake Powell right now we're gonna just take a little dip it's still really hot here so that's beautiful and uh, see that beautiful sky right now so I think it's gonna be awesome Hi, God. So good morning again. We are in Navajo country right now. Uh, we're actually at Antelope Canyon. Here we're gonna do a guided tour today. So uh, yeah, it's really hot. The sun is blistering right now. Middle of the desert. So uh, bring lots of water, put sunscreen on and have a good time. I don't get that. Why you can make photos, but you can't use a GoPro because there's no screen or something? It seems like I can't take any videos in the canyon. Photos are allowed, so I think I'm just gonna make some photos and uh, I'll tell you how it was afterwards. We did our tour. It was again really, really beautiful, beautiful rock formations. It was very touristy, lots of, uh, we had tours and there were tours going every 20 minutes. So it was very, very touristy there. And then we had to wait in line for a pretty long time to get in, but uh, it, was, uh, it was nice, it was beautiful. Another thing checked off the list. Right now we're going back to Walmart to buy some stuff and uh, going back to our, our campsite. So, I don't know since when I vlogged, I think it was in Antelope Canyon. But uh, right now we're back at our camp spot, as you can see. We're gonna take another dip in Lake Powell right now. I got my GoPro and we're gonna use these swimming, I don't know, like tires. Well, they look like tires, but I think they're like swimming bands right there. Gonna use these uh, swimming bands, which I've used actually before in Zion at the creek, so uh, we're gonna have some fun with that. So my first video is already uploading right now, but the internet is so slow. I think it's been going for like three hours. It says the whole time that's still like one hour and 50 minutes to go. But that was like the same two hours ago and still there, but it's a 50%. So I think it's gonna take another maybe three, four hours. So yeah, that's America number one. I think that's about four days delayed. But yeah, you know, I'm, I can't really be on time here because you know, we got a lot to enjoy, a lot to do instead of just working on the laptop the whole time because then you miss everything. But we have internet. It's better yeah, we do have internet here in the van actually. That's better than nothing yeah. as in most campgrounds. We had to go to the visitor center or do the reception. So that's good. So it is evening right now. We made it to our evening event thing, which is the all famous Warshoe Band. Where we are right now, they advised if you're gonna take photos and you wanna get the whole thing on, you have to get your wide angle lens. So I got that on my camera, which is the 10 to 18 millimeter Canon lens. 
uh, my camera is actually the 70D. I think I already showed you that in another video. That's the camera that I use for most of my pictures and video for uh, some of my video shots in the, in these vlogs as well. So. So that was Horseshoe Bend. Really, really beautiful. But the Chinese tourist level here is pretty high. So that's not great, but at least I know a little bit of Chinese so I can uh, make some friends maybe. Same as uh, in Antelope Canyon. Lots of Chinese tourists there as well. But uh, that's what you get with these really famous and beautiful spots. morning again lost my sunglasses so just gonna do a little bit without but uh, we're at Glen Canyon Dam today really late start today by the way it's uh, pretty much noon right now really nice looking dam here in the Colorado River that's Lake Powell crazy it's holding up the whole lake and there's the bridge so yeah chill day today we're gonna um, go to Monument Valley today. That's where our next campground is basically. So yeah, all in uh, Navajo country. Navajo, I don't know how you pronounce it really. But uh, yeah, I see a lot of uh, kind of South American looking people here and I think those are actually Native Americans. So that's it's pretty cool, it's pretty fun. Yesterday at Antelope Canyon we had a conversation with uh, the tour guide, John, which also was a Native American. So that was uh, quite interesting. Interesting place. Chinese win again. Man, this thing can even lift ships up. Crazy. It's just awesome that people can make that. It's just one small thing, hold up a lake, which is absolutely huge. So right now we're gonna go to Walmart again, see if there's a cosmetic section, because I got this thing on my nose, and I've had that for like really long, like pretty much since my 12 year old or something. But uh, right now this vacation is starting to sting and hurt a little bit so we're gonna go to the cosmetics and maybe they can uh, flash it out of there you know but we'll see that's where we're going now and after that monument valley so instead of going to cosmetics because they don't have it here they just have a uh, barber shop we are buying some new glasses because i have no idea where mine are so are they good using the screen to see it Oh, there are mirrors here. Oh, well, <laughs> bye. Made it. So here we have a Jeep tour actually, where we're gonna, I think we're gonna go through these natural structures and uh, see them up close, I think, so. Uh, it's gonna be very, very awesome.
in the, the early, the late fair and you start uh, start touring. So when the tourist comes here. So we made it back to our camp site. Just when you think it can't get much better. It always can in America, but uh, we're back. We can do another full hookup night, so that's very, very convenient. Uh, I think we're gonna go swimming and then uh, call it a night. So it is late, guys. It is evening here at the campground. Um, today was a pretty epic day. One more thing I want to talk about is the stars here. I don't really think you can see much of it right now, but what I see is just I mean, I can even see the Milky Way. It's amazing. Like at home in Holland, you don't see more than like maybe five or six stars per night. And here it's like so many, it's so awesome. So yeah, that's about it guys. I'm gonna go to bed. Thank you so much for watching. Please like if you did. Please subscribe if you haven't already for more adventures. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.